Welcome to my YouTube channel. Once again, I am back with an interesting question today. So in this question, two triangles are given. Triangle ABC, that means this triangle and triangle PQR, this triangle. Here, this angle B is 100 degree. So we are asked to find the value of angle R, that is X. Also here, we can see that AP is equal to let us name this point as M, P, M and likewise C, Q is equal to, let us name this point as N. So C, Q will be equal to Q, N. These conditions are given to us. So first of all, let us focus on triangle A, B, C. So I am drawing it separately. This is B. This angle is more than 90, 100 degree. Uh, this point is A and C. Let us assume this angle as theta 1 and this angle as theta 2. So by angle sum property in triangle ABC, theta 1 plus theta 2 plus 100 degree must be equal to 180 degree. So from here we will get theta 1 plus theta 2 equals 180 minus 100 that is 80 degrees. So this is theta 1 this is theta 2. Now focus on triangle APM. This triangle here AP is equal to PM. So it is an isosceles triangle. So this angle will also be theta 1. Similarly, if we focus on triangle QMC, it is also an isosceles triangle because QC is equal to QN. So this angle will also be theta 2. Now again, let us focus on triangle APM. Here, this angle will be an exterior angle. And exterior angle is sum of the opposite interior angles. So theta 1 plus theta 1, that is 2 times theta 1. Likewise, if we focus on this triangle QNC once again, this angle will be exterior angle. So the value of this angle will be sum of theta 2 plus theta 2 that is 2 times theta 2. Now let us focus on this triangle PQR. Let me draw it outside. So this is P, this vertex is Q and this is R. So R vertex is unknown that is X which we have to find. This is 2 times theta 1 and this is 2 times theta 2. We will apply angle sum property in this triangle PQR. So we will get 2 theta 1 plus 2 theta 2 plus x equals 180 degree. So we can take 2 common. So 2 times theta 1 plus theta 2 plus x will be equal to 180 degree. Now in place of theta 1 plus theta 2, we can substitute 80 degrees. So this will be 2 times 80 degrees plus x equals 180 degrees. So 160 degree plus x equals 180 degree. Let us subtract 160 degree from both sides. So this will get cancelled and we will be left with x equals 20 degrees. So the value of this unknown angle x will be 20 degrees. If you want to get more such interesting videos, do subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video.